Hey, today we're going to talk about how to put together a table for Halloween. Um, that's not really a holiday we've decorated for much since we moved in, but this year I decided to step things up a notch and I decided to show you all just a quick, like less than 10 minute way to throw together a pretty great Halloween table. You know, it's great for if you have little kids or if you're having people over to celebrate the holiday or if you're just really into celebrating and decorating for holidays, this is a great way to just add a little touch of whimsy and fun for Halloween. Um, basically everything you see here I picked up at Hobby Lobby or Target. It cost $43 for everything to put this table together which really isn't that bad when you're talking about a complete tablescape and of course you could always use more or less depending on kind of the look you were going for or just how much stuff you like to have on your table. Uh, basically what I did is I cleared off the chargers and decorations we already have and just left our placemats on paper napkins, just the basics that are always on our table because I like to, you know, continually use some of the same things and then just build on top of that. Um, so one of the quickest, easiest, cheapest ways to add a little bit of color to your table are these chargers, which I love these. We have these in more of a blue tone. That's what's normally on our table, but I decided to go with the orange for Halloween. These are $2 a piece at Hobby Lobby. They go on sale quite often, so you could actually get these all half price if you watch the sales and kind of build up your stock for each holiday. It's just a quick, easy way to change out your table. So, you know, we buy these in a lot of colors. Um, so basically all I will do is put one of these at each place. And like I said, they come in all kinds of colors. There's blues, creams, oranges. We have red we like to use for Christmas. Um, I just like to mix and match them just to add a little bit of fun. Especially if we're going to have people over to celebrate the holiday. It's just an easy way to add some decoration for them. Excuse me for dropping that. And not everything has to be perfect. You can adjust your table throughout the holiday until you get it exactly how you want it. But basically, I like to start with chargers. And then I have this beautiful centerpiece, which is a gorgeous cutting board that some of my family members got us for our wedding. But it's so nice, I hate to use it to actually cut anything up on. It's actually 18th century wood. So I typically use that to sit whatever our centerpiece is on just to give it a little bit of extra height. So while I was at Target in their dollar bin, which is absolutely a go-to place for when you're doing little holiday decorating, um, you're not going to get the highest quality pieces, but sometimes you can find some pretty great things and you're not going to break the bank to decorate, which is amazing. So I found these two pumpkins there yesterday. They were $3 a piece, which is a great price. They're very nice quality. They look like they're a lot more expensive than that. So I like to take something like this and put it in the middle, just as a bigger piece. And then I just happened to look in a smaller bin below those and found these adorable little orange pumpkins. They were actually only a dollar, which is a huge deal for something like this and this is a good way to add decoration to your table you can put them in your bathrooms your kitchen you can spread these little pumpkins pretty much throughout your house so what I decided to do with these was since I had five and I typically with little things like these like to use odd numbers because I think sometimes if you have even it just looks a little too matchy matchy so what I'm going to do is add one pumpkin here just to go with that odd number and just even everything out and then I'm going to scatter them across the rest of the table just to add a little bit more of the pumpkin look down there to even everything out. And then I found these trees, which if you're one that doesn't like a lot on your table, this might be a little bit of overkill, but I just thought it added some height, and especially if you have young kids or you just like that extra bit of whimsy, they're kind of fun. These are also from the Target dollar bins. They were $5 a piece, which is not bad. So I decided to get these just to kind of frame the centerpiece and like I said add a little bit more height there and also break up some of the orange and add in black as another accent color and once you're at this point you really could stop I mean it looks great the way it is it's very simple um, but something that I thought would be fun were I found these packs of multicolored pumpkins and I thought these would be so perfect if you were having a dinner party or having people over to go trick-or-treating on Halloween because you can put an individual pumpkin on everybody's plate that they could then keep and take home. And the nice thing about this is you have four different colors. Our dining room table is eight seats. So it's the perfect amount to alternate every other one so that everybody has 
a different pumpkin to look at. And like I said, these were only $3 a pack, which is a great deal. And you could always give them away or reuse them, either one. Um, I always like fun giveaways for people, so that would be perfect for that. And there you go. That's an entire Halloween table put together in absolutely no time. And like I said, for $43. You can't beat that price. It looks great. It's festive. And like I said, you can mix and match, take things out, add things. I saw some super cute um, decorative plates if you have young kids. It's some really fun Halloween kids plates. You can always add in some napkins. But either way, this pretty much covers what we want on our table. So this is what our table is going to look like for Halloween this year. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you do like, don't like, um, what you're planning to do for your Halloween table. And I hope you all enjoy it and have a very happy Halloween.